Hey, what's good, YouTube? Welcome back to the channel here. So, today's video, what I have for you guys is a long awaited video, man. In today's video, I'm going to be going over the best way to reverse boost. Uh, how do you do it step by step? How I do it, I've been doing it since the start of the game. So, I look, I know the ins and outs, the tricks, man. All you need, all you guys need to have to do to be able to reverse boost. Uh, I didn't want to make this video for a hot minute because I don't want this to get patched. I don't want this to come across like a dev or anything. Uh, so, they, they, they patch it. This is my way of having fun in the game. Uh, but now, I just want to make sure everybody has fun in the game, man. A lot of people come to my chat when because on stream i tell you guys how to do it so a lot of people are coming by my chat saying oh i dropped my free snoop drop my free sound bomb and i love seeing that so i'm going to share it to you guys on youtube man show you guys how to do it step by step everything you guys need to do uh to be able to reverse boost so hey aside from that man hope you guys enjoyed today's video and let's get into it before we actually go into the video i'm going to be showing you guys what you guys need to have uh to be able to do it if you guys don't have the equipment don't get like the maybe the money to buy the game uh twice i'm going to go into details about what you need but if you guys don't have what it takes you guys can stop by my stream man every day we do we do some six minutes i play with you guys we, i also reverse boost and there's some spots so you guys can join up so you guys can play in these lobbies drop some nukes drop some high kills be sure to stop by my twitch man if you guys want to come play with me you guys are more than welcome to play just come in come over there drop a little follow say what's up i mean on activision and you guys are going to be able to play so that's pretty much it now let's get into what you need to actually start reverse boost all right so before we actually start into how to do it you're going to need a couple stuff to do it i did a little quick image to show you guys what you guys are going to need to do you're gonna need two uh, platforms. So either one PC, one console, two consoles, two PC. You basically need two platforms to be able to play. So I have, personally what I have is one PC, one PS4. They both need to have the game on it. The PS4 can like be game shared from another account, like a friend's account or whatever. But you still need to have the game on both. Uh, you, get, you need an account that has the game on your PS4 and one on your PC. On the PC, it's like Battle.net, you can buy the game on it. Uh, so that's why I have I have one account on the PC that has the, that has the game. I want to count on PS4 that has the game. So this uh, represents account. You need three accounts in total. This one is your main account. Everybody has already their main account probably. Uh, this one's the good stats. You don't need to trash your stats at all. Don't touch that account. Your main account, uh, that's how we're going to call it today. Main account is the one your good stats. The one you're always rocking with and you're going to need two other accounts one that the one that is a bot account we're going to go into details about the stats he needs to have uh to be able to to call it a bot account and you also need another account like just a random account uh this is just something you can make like a random email a random psn and just and just log it in your ps4 it doesn't need to have the game it doesn't need to have any stats just just a random account on your ps4 uh just to, to connect a, a split controller we're going to go into details about that later uh but uh that that account is not important it's really the bot account that you're going to need uh but basically my bot account is the account that has cold war on it we bought it uh so need two accounts and you're also going to need two uh, one controller for each account because you're going to need to you can't just like unplug and replug and switch account because it's all things you need to do while they're all plugged in so you definitely need three input device i do with three controllers you guys can have like keep, like a keyboard and mouse on uh on your pc and like two uh, controllers for like your ps4 but if you play controller then you need three controllers at the end of the day so three input device so one platform, one, one account, one controller, everything. Uh, the, the then your other platform, like the game, two accounts, two consoles. So this is what you need to basically be able to reverse boosters. The only bad thing about this is yes, you need to have two consoles. Yes, you need to buy the game twice. If you guys don't have all that, man, I'm live every single day doing RB lobbies, reverse boosted lobbies, so you guys can join up on me and be able to play. There's a bunch of people, man, on stream that don't have the consoles, don't have the equipment they need to be able uh, to do this. So they, they just join up on me while I'm doing it. So that's an option you guys can do if you guys don't have all this but if you guys have all this man you guys are going to be ready to start reverse boosting now for the last step of preparation uh is preparing your bot account all right so your bot account needs to have trash stats uh now we're talking about my account personally I have a two spm so it gets one kill a game uh that's that's about the average i played like three to four games got one kill a game died like 30 to 40 times a game my account is two and 155 so his kd is a 0.01 KD has a two SPM. Don't try to don't don't play game modes that kill confirm. Just slap a little like uh, uh let, let, let's say like TDM and just and, and just hide. Just try to try to die as most as possible. Don't be running around the map too much because they take into consideration your movement to just crouch walk everywhere, lay down, miss your shots, like all this type of stuff. Play like a complete buy, and after that your body count is gonna be ready. So I'm gonna start off by showing you guys how to do it. Uh, I'm gonna be showing you guys at the bottom of the three controllers what wh which one is doing what uh, at the moment on screen. And you're, I'm also at the top gonna be uh, showing you guys like what what platform I am. If you guys see PS4, that's my bot account. That's the one I don't play with. That's one with the the trash stats. And then there's also my PC account with my good stats, my main account. That's the one I play with. So I'm always gonna be showing you guys all that to make sure you don't get lost. 
Now for the actual free step, you're gonna to need to start up the game on your body count on, on, on your PS4. Uh, mine is called X Mr. Bot. I started the game with that. And once it's locked in, I wanna connect my other controller, my second, uh, my split screen uh, to a random account. As you guys can see, mine is called Frost TV Packing. Uh, and uh, that, that's just a split screen, the random PSN. It has to have no stats at all, never played the game. You can have trash stats on it, it's not, but just make sure it doesn't have good stats, all right? It's just like a random account, doesn't need to have the game, doesn't need to have PSN. Nothing. So you want to start looking for games. Uh, you want to look for games with the bot account. Uh, my mine is called X Mr. Bot. So you want to look with the one that's leading the party, the one with the trash stats. Uh, it's gonna look for a game. Now on your main account, you want to make sure that the bot account is added. As you guys can see, I got X Mr. Bots added. Uh, this is on my PC, my main account, the good stat. I just want to hover over it and be ready to click join a game while he's looking for a game. I don't I, I don't want to press on it right away. Uh, I just want to hover over it, and be ready to actually join the game. Once your bot account has found a game, uh, this is where the tricky part, man. This is where a lot of people try, uh, tend to like mistake a couple of things. Uh, so I'm gonna be, I'm gonna try to explain it as uh, as well as I can. And so once your bot account has found a game with other people, if the game's already restarted, restart. It doesn't work. It's shot. You just want to make sure that there's, there's other players in there waiting for the game to start. Uh, and all these steps you're gonna need to do it before the actual game starts. So you kind of want to do this fast. But once you get the hang of it, man, it's super easy. It's not. You don't need to be like ultra fast. Uh, but basically what you want to do is you're going to back out with your split controller the, the the one the one account that has like that, that that's the random account like I, we were mentioning earlier you want to back out that account with it and as soon as you do that on your main account on your pc you want to click join game once you're joining the game is going to join on your bot account and then your main account is going to be in that lobby with other people that have trash stats and after that with your bot account you can back out just make sure you click leave alone and not bring party when you're backing out with your bot and after that, your main account is going to be uh, the one in the game with other uh, other trash player. And when you back out your bot account, there's also other people that can join up on you. And you guys can uh, reverse boost in like a little two man. So just to recap a little bit, you want to search up for games with a bot account and a split screen connected to it. And once you're looking for a game, you want to make sure on your PC, you're hovering over the, basically your main account, what you're playing on. You want to hover over the name, be ready to join. Uh, it has to be a hovering over the name that's hosting, the leader of the party. Uh, mine is called X Mr. Bot. You want to hover over it. Just wait. Don't join them run away. Once the bot account has found a game with other people, back out the split screen. As soon as you do that, click join on your other controller. Like one hand on both, do it, do it at the same time. Back out, join. It's going to join on the other account. And once your your main account is in, you can leave the bot there or you can back it out. If you're backing out, just make sure to leave alone and not bring party. And after that, you're gonna be your main account is going to be in the lobby with lowest skill players. So yeah, so that pretty much wraps it up, man, on how to reverse boost. Uh, it, it gets a bit complicated when you get like back out with like, this split screen and all that and set up the bot account. You just got to make sure you're, like, you're doing it with the right controllers. Once you get the understanding of it, man, when I, I've been doing it for like a couple months now, uh, you, but once, once you've been doing it for a couple days, man, you're just going to get the hang of it with, like back and out, what, 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 what controllers doing what. But don't worry about that. But uh, yeah, hey, like I mentioned earlier, man, if you guys got any question, comment down below man let me know or come by my twitch ask me so i can reply to you live uh but have like a conversation about it too uh, it's gonna be pr probably easier for me to answer those questions like that my link to my twitch is down in the description if you guys want to play with me also man link in the description that's where i get all my gameplays for youtube all that good stuff so uh yeah but aside from that man i really hope this video was useful hopefully you guys understood i try to be as clear as possible with like images uh like the povs and all that so i really hope it was <laughs> it helped you out but uh yeah hey aside from that man hope you guys gonna have a great day but cash guys later man peace out